Well, hey gang, uh, welcome to the Archer's Quest. I wanted to take a few minutes real quickly, and um, I wanted to welcome a new sponsor. And I'm talking about Creative Wildlife Supplements. Um, Bill, the owner, is a super guy. He hunts just like all of us do. And he's been working real hard, uh, probably the last year or so, or maybe even more than that, to create supplements that will help us bring deer in or hold deer and help them the deer get their full potential from his supplements. Now, what I'm going to be doing is, and we'll have this on an upcoming episode of the Archer's Quest, is I'm just going to go to Walmart, and I went, I have actually, I've already done it. I bought what a bucket feeder that's got a thing that sticks down, a plunger-like thing so the deer can hit it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to set that up. I'm going to put some corn in there and put his supplement in there. Because that's what a lot of people don't realize. A lot of people go and they buy these supplements and stuff like that. And they just pour them out on the ground. And they don't realize that really you need to put the corn with it. Even though it's got corn in it. You still need to add it to your corn. That way the deer will absorb more of it and eat more of it with that corn. But I wanted to welcome them, welcome them as a sponsor of the Archer's Quest. Also our returning sponsor, uh, Scent Capture. Uh, I've been using scent capture products for two, three years now, maybe, you know, as soon as they came out. And I tell you, you know, this is a little bit different than most stuff you see on the market. Uh, if y'all get a chance, go to scentcapture.com and you can read up on it. Instead of me telling you about it, I'd rather you read up on it and that way uh, you can find out firsthand what's going on. It is hot here in Kentucky, just my luck. I'm here today. I'm going to pull all the uh, cards out of the cameras and do the final setup on the stands, which is raking the trails in that, which will bring you. But I picked a great day to do it. I uh, got off work this morning, came home, went to bed. No more got to bed. And according to my wife, it started raining. And it's quit raining now. The skies are cleared up. Uh, the temperature has went from the mid-80s all the way up to the 90s, and it's humid. So... Next time you see me, I'll have I'll probably be soaked because I've got a cornfield to walk through that's behind me here to get to the woods. And I'd say I've got a good two plus miles to walk. So until next time, good hunting.